The primary cutting parameters for gear hobbing include the radial feed rate, the axial feed rate, the work spindle speed or work spindle RPM, and the hob spindle speed or hob spindle RPM. Other crucial factors to consider include the hob surface footage, which is the linear distance that a specific location on a rotating component travels in one minute, the type of coolant used, and coolant flow rate. The radial feed rate, also referred to as the depth of cut feed rate or just the feed rate, is the speed at which the hob moves in the x-axis direction to control the depth of cut of the gear tooth. Variables that affect the radial feed rates include the rigidity of the work holding setup, the maximum chip thickness, the gear material grade, and the material hardness. The axial feed rate is the rate of linear travel, typically in the z-axis, across the length of the gear blank, also referred to as the face width. Changes to the feed rates affect the cycle time. Lower radial and axial feed rates produce thinner chips. Higher feed rates produce thicker chips. Maximum chip thickness varies based on the manufacturer and model of the gear hobbing machine selected. The work spindle speed is the rate at which the work spindle turns the workpiece. The required work spindle speed will vary based on factors such as the material, the number of starts on the hob, the face width of the gear, the number of passes, and the radial feed rate that controls the depth of the gear tooth. Other determining factors for work spindle speed include the axial feed rate and hob spindle speed, or the rotational rate at which the hob spins.